welcome back everybody it is Hank Todd back with another Hank Todd video today guys starting off at the farm another awesome day on Lone Oaks guys it's awesome um what we're doing is today guys we got harvest going down over here I've already knocked out a little bit um we got the new tractor out here on that grain car and we got the new tractor down there also on our grady wagon we got the 8970 I believe 8970 and we got the new combine out here rolling today uh guys we did make another new purchase to the farm one thing i did do was the razor went too slow so i upgraded it i did a couple of uh you can do like some things to where you do these things for other people and uh there's a, there's a new truck for some reason don't know how this truck got here actually i do guys i went and bought it um it is a really nice chevy 1500 i felt like the ram was just too big and you couldn't really like run to town if you needed something or, or something like that it was just too big to do that in razor really don't want to drive it all the way to town so i thought we'd just buy us a nice little chevy 1500 so guys i spent an extra 20 grand on this truck for it to do basically nothing um great mod by the way whoever made it it is a really good mod oh forgot my razor was there because I did spend like an extra twenty thousand dollars on it. It is an eight cylinder. It was just gonna be a four cylinder, but I spent an extra like twenty thousand and made it an eight cylinder and it hardly even changed it. Now the razor goes 124. It's touchy with the gas. Um but used to it went seventy-four if you guys have ever paid attention to the little speed thing gauge. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna hop in this. I'm gonna back it out. I'm just gonna leave the razor there for now. I'm gonna back this up, and I'm gonna head on out to the wheat field in it. It is really nice. Interior's really nice. So uh, we're gonna take. It is a really nice truck, guys. It drives really smooth, super clean looking, and I love it. Oh, sorry about that. Um, whoa, about hit that. Okay, we're just gonna park it right there. Actually, I need to take it over here. One thing is, guys, I need to get the... I love that startup sound. Um, we're going to get the combine running. All right, we're going to get this combine running. We're going to fire her up. There we go. She's going. Hire a worker on that. I'll hop back into this. Back it up. Here, guys, just listen to this sound. Oh, man, that sounds so good. So good. All right, I'm just going to park that right there for now. I'm going to hop in the 8970 and start ripping. Uh, that's what I've been basically doing the whole day. Oh, bad one. Throw that back down. Um, just trying to rip up what we're doing. Well, what we've already done. Kind of taking out some crop there. Uh, that should be alright, though. We have so much wheat, guys. It's not even funny right at this point. I sold like three loads of it, but that was hardly even enough guys you do not know all the work i do off camera i know you guys probably hate it but uh i loaded all the bells out of that one field and i got that all uh got that one field bells out of it got it all disked up and uh i cleared some trees on it because the 8970 had some troubles uh had some troubles back in turning and stuff so with the trees in the way so i had to move some trees anyways the ripper got caught on some trees so i had to clear those and everything so uh yeah i did that ton of stuff you guys don't really know all the work i put in off camera you guys probably just think i do all this stuff on camera really guys i have put in 105 hours on this game since i've had it and uh so that's a lot of hours just for farming sim because i mean and I definitely not had 105 hours on camera, so I do a ton of work off camera, just trying to make it ready for the video. Um, it's a it's a lot of hassle just to get it ready for this one video. So uh, yeah, but uh, yeah, so we got a ton of mods. Everything I'm using out here in this field and basically on this series is a mod. So you guys cannot get these in the game. By the way, I was actually looking at FS19 tonight. Sorry about that lag. I was I was looking at FS19 tonight. Not going to get it yet because, you know, we we're starting this series and everything. I think we're on, like, episode number six. And, uh, so everything's going really, really well. We're just going to go ahead and keep rolling. I did a couple of jobs for, like, the local farmers. Um, you can actually help people out on this game, so that is really neat. I earned, I don't know, about, give or take, 
$12,000 off doing that. So not a whole lot, but it was enough. And uh, then I just been ripping and unloading the combine. So, uh, yeah. Moving on with harvest, guys. Last field. I'm thinking about purchasing some more land. I'm actually going to shut the 89 down. And I'm going to take you guys and show you the new land I feel like I should purchase. I'm just going to take the old Chevy. It's actually not an old Chevy. It's like brand new. But uh, the land I was thinking about purchasing, it was field number... Honestly, guys, I was thinking about field 50, but that is the biggest field, obviously, on the map. Alright, we need to head the other way, I think. Yes, we need to head this way. I was thinking about purchasing, like, field 49. 34 would not be a bad one. Let's head on down to field 50, guys. I think that would be really fun to try and take on field 50. Um... This new Chevy, guys, love it. It is an awesome truck. Do you guys like third person or first person? I need to know that, by the way. Leave that in the comment section. That way it does help me because then I will drive in whatever view you guys want me to. So we're just going to go ahead and come right on down here. Field 50, I think it's planted in sunflowers, if I'm not mistaken. So it would have to disc it all up and everything. So it would be awful. If you guys hear talking in the background, sorry. That is... That's my sister. Um, we're going to go ahead and pull into field 50 if I can figure out where. Okay, so we got some rocks around it for some reason. I do not know why. Whoa. Sorry about that unreal realisticness. <laughs> my bad. Um, yeah, we're kind of driving through some tall sunflowers. Um, I'm trying to find where the cell point is. There it is. All right, perfect, guys. We could have taken the road, but who needs a road? All right, we're just going to go ahead and back this thing right off here. Now, I'm not going to use this ever to pull the 40 foot unless I really have to because that is not a truck that needs to be pulling a 40 foot trailer. So it's $229,000, guys. Obviously, cannot buy it. We could do a mission for it. That would be $19,000, but we cannot purchase it at this moment um i i am really looking for some land though i do do want some land i really really do so i've been looking around trying to find some places for some land all right let's check out this field how much do they want for it looking for a good yeah like 163 thousand it's a little steep um all right i'm just gonna go ahead and come oh man Hey, right there's the guy that we bought the tractor off of our case. All right, I'm going to go ahead and drive back up to my farm. And I completely took the wrong way, but that ain't no big deal because I know a shortcut. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, guys, we're going to have to take a shortcut of mine. Maybe that ain't a shortcut. All right, we're just going to take this little shortcut of mine here. I'm really good at shortcuts. Don't worry. All right, we're just going to go back through here. we got to make our way through these trees, guys. How hard can it be? Oh, I didn't even know there's a, a barn back here and stuff. Alright. We should make it through here. I can't see a thing. Uh, I'm trying to find my way through here. Alright. Not that way. Field 38 is where I need to head. Perfect. Alrighty. This field's already planted. Where am I at exactly? Oh, whoa. I'm going the complete wrong way. I would like to see how much they want for this. This is not a bad little field. Easy to access for us. Would be very easy to access. We could think about this one, guys. I mean, do we want this? We could think about it. It's It doesn't look like it would be that expensive because really the fields on this map aren't that expensive. So, uh, 86 grand. Not bad. I do not know if I have, like, the maximum loan out that I can take. Oh, my bad, my bad. I'm trying to unlock these straps that I accidentally locked. There we go. Alright. So, guys, I've already taken a loan out from the bank. If we have not, we could possibly... Okay, yeah, no, we've taken a big loan out. We need to pay that loan off. As soon as we get $300,000, guys, we really need to pay that loan off. That is completely my fault. I spent $300,000 of the bank's money, did not pay it back, and then I've been spending all the money that I make. So, probably not a good idea. But, uh... <laughs> All right, perfect. Now all we gotta do is we just need to come down through here. Did I mention this Chevy can float too? Oh yeah, really good at floating, guys. It is like a pro. I took the Razor down here actually today. 
check some things out and stuff. Alright, we'll just come right up through here. Chevy, guys, it's got the power, don't worry. Alright, let's go ahead through here. Back to the farm. We're just going to go ahead and park the Chevy here at the farm. Yeah, we'll just pull her back up. One thing about this thing is, guys, horrible brakes, but it is an awesome truck. I love it. I cannot remember who made it when I downloaded it, but uh, it is a great mod. There we go. Guys, this is going to be the end of the video. I really hope you guys did enjoy, and guys, I will see you all on the next.